Hello there, friends, and welcome back to Hades, where we are about to uncover a set of new abilities. Our mother, or our not-mother, as we discovered an episode or two ago, uh, has unlocked this mirror to provide us some additional talents that we go are going to want to take advantage of. So let's take a look. So I noticed two things right off the bat. There's these arrows, which... are these... Oh, we can swap between talents. Oh, neat. Okay, so that's the first thing I noticed. The second one is this unlock talents. We need to collect five keys to reveal two new talents hidden inside the mirror. Or hidden inside us, it says. So let's um, let's try to collect five keys so we can get some more of these benefits. And let's see what these other abilities are. It looks like we're going to have to choose between them, unfortunately. So all the, all the uh, money, so to speak, that we put into these would be a little bit, uh, have gone to waste. Although it seems like, yeah, we could use a key to un to get a reset if we wanted to. So let's see what we have here. We'll do these uh, all in order. Fiery Presence, deal attack and special damage when striking undamaged foes. That's pretty nice. Versus the striking foes from behind. Ooh. Do I like the undamaged one better? I think I almost do, especially I'm thinking when we have all those skeleton heads or crystals coming for us and there's like 15 enemies we have to hit at once and striking them with our AoE ability, whatever it is, and doing bonus damage would be super duper nice. So let's save our crystals for now, but I think we want to put our points into this. But So until we can max it or until we can get a reset and get some crystals back from Shadow Presence... Um, we'll keep that in mind. Dark Regeneration. Restore some of your health when you collect crystals. 30% of the collected amount per rank. That sounds amazing. Um, definitely want to do that. Stubborn Defiance. Restore 30% health instead of dying when your life total is depleted one time per chamber. Oh, that's super duper helpful. But that's 600, because that's obviously almost like an overpowered ability. And then Ruthless Reflex, gain 50% damage and dodge for 2 seconds when you dash just before getting hit. Versus 2 dashes. I don't know, I kind of like having 2 dashes available to us. Stubborn Defiance we can't even afford, so let's just switch back there. But Dark Regeneration, however, we get crystals fairly often. So whenever we collect crystals, being able to collect health at the same time, that sounds great. So let's go ahead and get those. So 60% of our crystals. So if we get 10 crystals, we get 6 health back. I like it. And we've got 100 crystals left over. Good. So without further ado, what weapon do we want to take? Yeah, something back there for you, pal. Something back where? Oh, a new weapon, huh? Oh, that, is it like an infinity gauntlet? What the heck is that? That takes eight keys, though, so... It'll be a little while before we can afford it. So we can get a crystal bonus from equipping the shield. Or we can go with the sword, which I think has been my favorite so far. Just, you know, it's basic, but it's effective. Hmm. I guess let's go with the... Which one? Which one? Which one? I guess let's go with the shield, because additional crystals mean additional health, right? You know something, Boyo? I think you could do a real number on one of these columns holding up this place and bring the whole thing down in just a few swipes. Boom, boom, boom! And hate to be standing near one of them if you did. Yeah, I could. Wreck my father's finely crafted and I have. Every chance I get. That I can do for sure. Trust us, Skelly. We know a thing or two about knocking columns over. We are fairly proficient at it. Ooh, Daedalus' hammer. What sort of invention can we get here? Bull Rush charges up faster. Dash Strike deals 50% damage in a larger area. Your Bull Rush gains a Power Rush that deals 500% damage. What does that mean? Uh, nice. Let's try that. I should do it. Oh, wow, look at that. It goes there, and then after a second... Uh, did that not work?
It says deals 500% damage. I don't really see it kick kicking in. Maybe I'm not understanding what it's supposed to do. Hang on. Your bull rush gains a power rush that deals 500% damage. Okay. Uh, were we dealing 500% damage there? It still seems pretty low. Okay, it's one of them down. There we go, we got crystals. But we're at full health, so... No need for any health bonuses. More brimstones. Pretty good. Ooh, let's hide behind here. I don't know. I don't like that. Their little zappy ability. Are there a couple more here we're going to be able to take out? Yeah, there we go. Solid. Lucky Tooth, rank up. Oh, what did we get? So, hang on. Can we take a look at that? Where's our Lucky Tooth? Automatically restore up to 75 when your life total is depleted. I like that. You've met your distant relatives by now. We don't all share the same demeanor nor see eye to eye. Though, all of us, I think, wish you the best. I appreciate that. I really do. Your dash deals damage and can deflect. Uh, yes. That seems great. Turn foes attack, uh, foes attacks back against them, and we dash all the time. We're never not dashing. Go grab a key. And if we get, what is it, five keys, we can, um... Upgrade our um, abilities, our talents. Efficient. This can unlock a weapon back at home. Oh, yep, max health. Thank well, you, thank you. I'll take that off your hands. Oh, dash out of there. that bomb going. Ha. Huh. That, uh, that bomb ended up getting her. That skull going. Where are they? Sweet. That's good. I think we got a good amount of deflections there. It's a little hard to tell, but reflecting that damage back at enemies seems nice. Oh man. We basically just triggered everything at once. I saw this urn there. Where are you? Oh boy. Got him. Dash across. Where are the last ones? Good deal. Mine now. Now we're going to get a gift from Hades. Or uh not Hades, Ares. Oh, these guys, huh? Oh, yeah. So our dashing, let's try to dash near them and see what that does. It does do some damage, not like a tremendous amount of damage. Yeah, we're doing, what, like 12 damage each time we dash around them? That's pretty good, considering that we're dashing, like, every second, essentially. So it's adding up. Uh, 
Cool. When you let your heart win. Oh. Oh, yeah. I also think that. We can get him to help us out, or our attack special and cast deal more damage. I mean, that's pretty good. Everything dealing more damage all the time. How can I say no? Are there any urns here that we can break for money? I think we destroyed about just about all the urns that are available. There's the well. We're going to have to go visit it when we get out. combo. Alright, who is this here? Oh, hello. Keep moving. Pretty good. That damage, I think, is actually kicking in fairly nicely. Ah, come on. I hate it when I dodge right into the trap. We got him down. Down you go. And what is this? Restore up to 27 for 36. Tempting, but that would be a little bit of a waste. 50% damage striking foes from behind. Your attack deals plus 30% damage. That is very useful. And then we have this chaos gate here. Ooh, I don't know. Do we want to make the trade-off? Take a pretty decent hit to our health for something of dubious value. Uh, let's do it. Maybe it'll be something good. Most solitary, darkest of yeah, we I'd best take all the evidence I find. We knew that already. Uh, we could give him a gift if we wanted to, but no, we're we're saving these for Cerberus. And he seems kind of evil. What's that? My shield? Right, it is very offensive, if that's what you mean. For the next three encounters, your dash has minus 39% range. Afterwards, gain plus one cast. For the next four encounters, take extra damage from traps. Afterwards, your attack deals more. Or the next five chambers, reward previews are hidden. Let's do the traps. I think we've done a pretty good job of avoiding traps for the most part. So as long as we just stay away from spikes and, you know, all that good stuff, we should be okay. Strike, uh, you know, spikes just like that. Well, they keep coming, don't they? Is there, a, like, a... Something that's creating them? These, uh, these skeleton heads? Or what? Oh, look at this guy trying to hide. Thinks he's so smart, huh? Yeah. Oh, give us some health. There we go. We got a little health bonus as a result. Oh, man. Do we want to anger a god and get two bonuses or buy something? A hundred is not a lot. 100 is not a lot, so... Yeah, let's go here. Probably gonna regret it, but... Favor to choose. Do we want Ares' gift, or do we want Athena's gift? Decisions, decisions. Well, first let's look and see if there's any urns in here that can give us money. Uh, no, they all seem like normal urns. Unfortunately. Hmm... So Athena's gifts seem to do a lot of 
like, defensive and reflecting. And Ares have to do a lot with just straight damage output. Let's go with uh, Athena, I think. I mean, we're going to get both. Doesn't really matter. Your abilities that can deflect also make foes exposed, which means they take more damage when struck from behind. Uh, I mean, we're not always in a position for that to be um, be applicable. Or get a phalanx shot. I think this is good. Let's get a cast to do something. Yeah, Ares doesn't like that. We know. Yeah, yeah. Alright, let's get out of there. Oh, he's got his little uh, god shot he's gonna do at us. Doesn't like that very much. Oh boy, these the witches are the worst. Come on, deflect, deflect. Yeah, we took a nice shot there. Ooh, good one. Come on, get him, get him. Down you go. Ooh. Holy guacamole. Well, we get this anyway. Yeah, I, I'll consider it. Attack inflicts doom. We can get a Ares aid or we can do death defiance. We use our attack all the time. Um, I guess we may as well look in here, huh? Restore 10% when you enter a chamber. Hydrolite. <laughs> I like that. It's good for electrolytes. Also a reference to the Hydra. 50% from striking foes behind. 50% to armor. Let's do this. 10% when we enter a chamber. Let's get some nice healing going. Do we want an upgrade or do we want a Zeus ability? Let's do Zeus. Ooh, a nice phalanx ability. I like that. All right. Ooh, that trap almost did us in. Wow, that doom on our basic is nice. You do that. Oh, we're deflecting things like crazy. Down you go. What you got for me, Zeus, baby? Um, not really. Not quite correct. I tried to match him up with some more wholesome types, but no. And here we are. Well, yeah, we'll, we'll we'll talk we'll talk to Zeus later. Let him know what's really going on. So, do we want after we take damage, foe struck by lightning? After you dash just before getting hit, bolt strikes a nearby foe, or special causes a lightning bolt to strike. Probably more dashing, right? Two dash, two furious. So our dash will do damage. And it'll deflect. Yeah. Oh, I just saw an urn in the corner that we could have gotten for more benefits. Oh, and we're 125 away from being able to buy something. Is there any money in here? Please? No. Not so. Fine day to you as well there, mate. Now let's have a look at your supply, shall we? Man, how nice would this heart be? Real nice. Real, real nice. We can get some crystals by twenty, by thirty crystals for twenty-five. That's that's fine. That's reasonable. And let's go fight the fury. I'm here, Meg. Listen to me, Zagreus. Your mother is long gone. You're never getting out of here, and even if you did, what hope could you possibly have in finding her up in the world? Out like mother, like son. If she got out, I can get out too. Not that it's any of your business anymore. Your family is here. And so is your responsibility. 
You're running from yourself. Though, I can slow you down a bit, I think. Yeah, well, it hasn't worked out too well so far for you. Oh, come on, stupid trap. Nice. Ooh, get out of there. Oh, she loves her little carpet bombing, doesn't she? We got her to half health. Yeah, yeah. What's happening? I thought she was going to do her little carpet bomb thing on us. But she did not. I'm doing my basic attack and not uh, dashing, or um, not doing the, the strategy from last time, just because all the doom I get. There we go, that kicks in. Uh, because the doom that we inflict on our basic is getting her extra damage. Impervious. There we go. Yep, yep. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Boom. No, I didn't. I asked for nothing of the sort. Almost got her, come on. Block that shield. Okay, dash down here. Come on, get her down. There we go. I'll see ya. Gotcha that time, Meg. Yeah, we've done pretty well about uh, getting her. We got a little bit of healing. Very nice. That's sixty percent of our crystal income, healing us up. And we still have the Lucky Tooth, so... Not bad. Not bad at all. And we're gonna get healing from the fountain. That's 30 health. I guess that's just a free heal. Let's keep going. And we could switch our keepsake if we wanted to. My keepsake collection. Just what the house contractor ordered. Yes, indeed. So, Lucky Tooth still is around. Um... Yeah. That seems good to me. Let's just keep it on there. We could buy something if we wanted. Restore 10% when you enter a chamber. Deal 50% when da damaging un uh, striking undamaged foes and gain movement speed. Those all seem pretty good. Can we afford them all? Let's see, that's 75, 85. Yeah, let's just buy them all. Boom, boom, boom. We are going to be in a really good spot. Next floor. All right, let's see if we can make it back to that Hydra. I would like to give give it another shot. And I feel like with our current build, we've got a pretty good sh good uh, chance to make it through. We're going to get something from Hermes, it looks like. Yeah, that Doom on our basic is very nice. kind of cleans it up for us a bit. We'll just let them come to us. This is actually a decent spot to fight. Ooh. Well, except for whoever's throwing stuff at us. Oh, we can deflect these back at them. Or it kind of looked like it for a second there. Alright, let's come over here. Get these witches out of here. Oh, get out of there. Alright. Not bad. Hey, Hermes. What you got for me? Something here for you should make your battles to the death end that much quicker. 
You can call me whatever you want. Special is faster. You can dash more times in a row. Or after you dash, briefly become sturdy and move 100% faster. 30% less damage. Your actions cannot be interrupted by taking damage. Yes. We dash all the time. Our character is basically built around dash at this point. Anything over here? Let's just take a look at the area. Oh, we got some money. Nice. So it looks like the urns are not always in super obvious places, so we'll just have to look around to see if there's any golden urns that we can uncover. Uh, nope. Looks like that's it. So do we want pomegranate, upgrade to our ability, or some coin? Let's go with a straight cash, homie. And we got a very nice heal from the upgrade that we bought in the previous chamber. <laughs> Sucker. Ooh, there's a lot of you guys, huh? There you go. Down you go. Who else we got? Ah, uh, I was clear careless. Ooh, get out of there. Yeah, we've got a decent amount of deflections going. Oh, come on. Alright. Hundred big ones. Alright, urns, urns. Just gonna go around and break stuff. I want my money and I want it now. Nothing up there. Um, nope, nothing that's dropped money. We can go use our money to go see Karen. Or we can go... Ooh, are we going to go see Sisyphus? Or we can go get more money. Let's go see uh, Sisyphus, I guess. Or I assume it's going to be him. Not exactly sure. Who is this? Come on in. Okay. Oh. I like this song. I just kinda wanna sit here and soak it up for a second. Could dash clear through that wall, I think. Yeah, shh, I'm listening.
falls away. Man, I love it. I love... I could just sit here and let her sing as long as she wanted, but I guess we'll go ahead and talk to her, huh? Hey, you must be the Hades kid. Eurydice. Oh, your royal majesty. Nice to meet you. I'm Eurydice. What brings a big, important guy like you up to a place like this? Okay, so the muses are essentially the goddesses that inspired everybody who is an artist of some kind, whether that means painting, sculpting, story writing, singing, performing, acting. And there was a different uh, muse for a variety of different practices. You know, there's one for acting, there's one for geography, there's one for writing. However, Eurydice is not traditionally one of the names of the muses. I don't remember her being a muse. She is Orpheus's wife. Orpheus being like the one of the most famous musicians of the underworld and actually she um, Was taken to the underworld. I think she was bitten by a snake and Orpheus went to the underworld to try to retrieve her and He moved Hades heart um, By playing a song that was so sad that Hades agreed to let Eurydice go back to the surface on one condition That Orpheus would not turn around and look at his wife on the way up and of course wouldn't you know it he gets suspicious, close to the top, he thinks Hades is tricking him, he turns around. Eurydice was there, but because he broke the contract, essentially, she has to go back to the underworld. And here she is. So, has she, I guess she's now become a muse, because uh, ordinarily, she's just a human. Interesting stuff. Hi there. No need for formalities, I'm Zagreus. Just heading out on some official business, past the menacing Bone Hydra. I don't mean to be rude, though I'm in a bit of a rush. Well, don't you have your hands full, hon? I'll let you go. But there's one rule in my place, which is... Nobody leaves here empty-handed. You got that? I can get on board so with that. Pick. My treat. Alright, what do you have? So something slightly different than what Sisyphus was offering us. Oh, she's a nymph. Yeah, so I guess she she's a wood nymph that uh, Orpheus fell in love with. But still not usually a muse. Anyway, Ambrosia Delight. Uh, up to two random boons of yours are upgraded to the next rarity. Or up to four random boons that gain plus one level. Or the next three boons you find have upgraded rarity. I'd rather just upgrade what we have right now. So do we want to upgrade to a rarity or do we want plus one level. I don't know what the rarity means. Does that mean it totally changes what the boon actually does? Because if that's the case, I would rather just have a plus one level to the ones we already have. I think that's preferable. Excellent. So what do we get? Lightning reflexes, wow, curse of agony, phalanx shot, all of those get to level two. Yeah. All right, take it easy, Eurydice. Keep it squeezy. Oh, not this thing again. Okay. Oh, and this little bangy guys. Well, we are dealing quite a bit of damage with our basic. Yeah, look at that. We're just wrecking it. Almost got her down. There we go. Now just this guy to take care of, huh? Let's just dash and get away from his, uh, his little drop from orbit. Take that doom. Take it. Take it. Take it. Take it. Until next time, gigantic organ head. Yeah. Hopefully there's not a next time. Ooh, you're in no shape to be going off. What happened to you there? Yeah. Let me see if we can get you back into it, man. I love, I love his voice acting. Just his, like, personality. He's just like... You're all good here, man. Using a fountain restores all health and gives you bonus damage. Take less damage at 40% or below. Damage resistance. Definitely. Let's liven things up. Definitely. Let's hope we get some healing. No healing. I guess that thing we bought at the beginning for, uh... A bit of a heal each time we go to a new chamber that has not 
it's not here anymore. There you go. Alright, bring him on. Who's coming? Oh, all these guys. Alright, that's fine. You all just grouped up for me. Is that it? Nope, not it. Not it. Come a bit closer. Oh, we deflected our attacks back at them because they are trying to turn us into stone. Look at that. Not bad. Now I saw something over here. What is this? Oh, if we wanted to sell some of our boons, which I don't think we want to. Alright, any urns here that need to be a broken? Hmm, doesn't look like it. Alright, let's go cri get crystals, because crystals mean health. With our little upgraded ability. Who are we taking on this time? Okay. Nice. Alright, let's get out of the way. Let's let him get back into dry land. Where's the rest of them? Oh, there you go. Oh, there's a whole bunch of them. Okay. Wall slam. Anybody survive? Nope, just new ones. Nice. We're dealing a lot of passive damage, just like all of our dodging and reflecting and deflecting. Ooh, that was not good. And the doom that we do on the basic. Yeah, we don't even have to be near them to, to uh, put a hurting on them. Anything good that we can pick up? Any urns that might drop some sweet cash for us? I wouldn't say no. We've got 260. That is quite a bit. I think a trip to the Sea the Boatman is in order. I don't see any golden urns standing out to me. So. Boat Daddy, here we come. Let's go. Any more cash down here? What about over here? Nope. Oh, this is the last level before the boss. So, let's see. We've got 260. So we could get this thing in from Athena and this health. We can't get all three, though, because that would be what? Uh, 325. So let's get um, 30 health. Oh, that's not very much. Okay, fine, whatever. I'll get that. And then do I want more max health? Or whatever this is from Athena. Ooh, that's tough because she is all about defense. She is all about defense. For going against a boss, though... Uh... Going against a boss, I think more health is preferable. There we go. Alright. I'll be seeing you, Karen. So, uh, this looks like a pretty good place to pause. So next episode, we were going to have our second shot against the Bone Hydra. We made it to about 30% of his health. We got him almost down. And um, I think we're a little bit tougher this time. We've got some better abilities upgraded in our skill tree. So next time, let's see if we can actually break out of Asphodel. Wouldn't that be nice? Make it and see what 
lies beyond this godforsaken river of lava area. In any case, if you can drop a like if you enjoyed the video, that's always appreciated. Be sure to comment below on what you think of Asphodel and uh, what you think of Eurydice and her singing. It's really, really beautiful. could listen to that uh, all day long, really. And uh, as always, be sure to subscribe if you want to see where Prince Zagreus' uh, story heads next. I can't wait for next time, but for now, I'll talk to you later. Bye for now.